Dr. Harford, how, how, how good of you to come. I came as soon as I got the message. Oh, thank you. I'm so, I'm so sorry. Oh, well, thank you. Your father was, uh, he was a very brave man. Oh, thank you. How are you holding up? Uh, uh, I'm a bit numb. I don't think it's really sunk in yet. Uh, would you like to sit down? So unreal. Daddy had such a good day. His mind was clear. He remembered so many things. And then he had a little dinner. And he said he felt like taking a nap. I, um, I went into the kitchen and uh, talked to Rosa for half an hour at most. And uh, when I went back in to see how he was, I. I just thought he was asleep. <laughs> and then I... And then I realized he wasn't breathing. Marion, from what you've said, I'm sure your father died peacefully in his sleep. Oh, God, I hope so. I think I've been more afraid of the way it was actually going to happen, then his death itself. Have you had a chance to phone any of your relatives? Uh, I, um, I tried to call my stepmother in London, but uh, she was out. My boyfriend Carl is uh, making some calls and uh, he'll be coming over soon. I think you met Carl here a few times. Yes, I remember him. He's a teacher, isn't he? A math professor. We are going to get married in May. Well, that's wonderful news. Congratulations. Thank you. Carl has a new teaching appointment at the University of Michigan. We'll be moving out there soon. Well, Michigan's a beautiful state. I think you like it a lot. Yeah. It really could be a wonderful change for you, Marion. Um. Oh. I don't want to go away with Carl. Mary, I don't think you realize. I do. What? Even if I'm never to see you again, I want at least to live near you. Mary, listen to me. Listen to me. You are very upset right now, and I don't think you realize what you're saying. I love you. Mary, we barely know each other. I don't think we've had a single conversation about anything except your father. I love you. Oh, and that's probably Carl. Oh, please don't despise me. Darling. I'm sorry. 
so very sorry. Are you all right? I'm okay. Dr. Harford, good evening. Good evening, Carl. Thank you very much for coming over here tonight. It's the least I could do. It means a lot to us. Thank you. Well, I was, uh, I was actually on my way out. Marion, your father was very proud of you. And I know you gave him great comfort these last months. Thank you. Thank you. Well, well, I'll uh, show you out. Mm -hmm. 